the grenade. This is the grenade. This is the grenade. Welcome to the Grenade Game Show. We got a great show for you today. Our first question. What is the name of the weapon? Grenade. Thank you, Olivia. Okay, now, what is the model of the grenade? M24 saw grenade. <laughs> yes, Mary, that was correct. All right, what country was the sock grenade made? You're sitting there. Germany. Thank you, Corinna. All right, who invented the weapon? I honestly don't even know what I'm supposed to say. Oh, will you know? Ah! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry about that. Um, okay, no, try again, sorry. William Millis, 1915. Nice job, Mary. All right, now when was the weapon first used in World War I? It was used in 1915. Nice job, Olivia. All right, now how does this weapon operate? Um, you pull the pin out of it, and you throw it, and then it blows up. Yay! How is the weapon used on the war front to gain advantage over the enemy? Leaning and thrust in <laughs> <laughs> Effective against armored vehicles and fortifications could be used in an improvised Bundell style. What did the German soldiers dress like? Long green button coat with a circular hat, belt buckle, black pants, and boots. Alright, now I'll demonstrate how the grenade works. Now you run away, Krina. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> now I hide. This is a grenade in action. <laughs> because the grenade's such a small weapon, you'll never know who has it. Go. Oh my god, man, my trench foot's so nasty. you have been in these trenches so long. I know, right? So oh. Boom. <laughs> Go. Knock, knock! Are they Grenades! The grenade is 365 millimeters. That's big. 365 millimeters converts to 14.4 inches. The diameter of the grenade is 70 millimeters. The grenade weighs 595 grams. Go. Ah, my finger! <laughs> grenade in combat with large crowds of people rather than targeting just one person at a time. The grenade is a perfect size and weight to use in combat because it's easy to throw. Grenades are the perfect weapon because you can kill people in close range um, and it can be a mass amount of people and they won't even see it coming and it makes a big explosion and it can take out people far away. So Mary, what do you find different about the grenade and the shotgun? The grenade kills more people and it's more effective than the shotgun. So you're saying that the grenade is more you know, like efficient in, in terms of like killing a lot of people? The sure. shotgun. Yeah. Thank you, Mary. <laughs> what do you think about the grenade? So you're supposed to say, um, like, compared to the shotgun. Compared to the shotgun. So what do you think about the grenade compared to okay, the shotgun? Okay, well, the shotgun, you have to, like, aim at a certain person. But the grenade, you can just kind of throw it and it can blow up, like, a bunch of people. Cool. So, yeah. All right. So, same thing that Mary said. So, cool. Blah. Blah. What do you like more about the grenade and the shotgun? I like that the grenade is easier to like throw, so you can like just throw it and you don't have to like make sure you're hitting something at all times because it's just there in the crowd and then it goes boom and then everyone's dead. So boom and then everyone's dead. Yeah, like, and it's not just like, like not bang like, and then one person's dead, it's like boom and like everyone's dead. So they're not like wounded like, oh my leg, it's yeah, like, you're like dead. You're like, bye. Oh. You're just like gone. Bye bye. All right, thank you, Olivia. This is our grenade. It's very precious. <laughs>